in hell, man. Update to a story we brought you yesterday. A teenage girl is in custody after police say she was involved in a string of assaults and robberies earlier this week. One was caught on camera, and it was a story you saw first on WUSA 9. Our John Duran spoke to a woman who says she nearly fell victim to a similar attack. After that, the same teens followed her for blocks. Parts of an assault and attempted robbery Sunday afternoon were caught on video. What's going on? Kate Rio says two girls who looked like teenagers approached her in D.C.'s Penn Quarter neighborhood, threw her to the ground, and kicked her head. I was this is literally blocks from the White House. Like, when they say blocks from the White House, a lot of times they're lying when these D.C. stories, when they say yeah, blocks from the White House or blocks. From, they're just using that, like, as, like, a catchphrase. This right here is literally blocks from the White House. And look at these boom sheikas that beat that white lady up, man. A string, a string, not just one, a string. A string of robbery, these sisters running back to the car. Oh, right. Kate Rio says two girls who looked like teenagers approached her in D.C.'s Penn Quarter neighborhood, threw her to the ground, and kicked her head. I was keeping my head um, covered as much as I could. To be honest, I was... I didn't know anyone was going to um, come help me. After WUSA 9's reporting, police say they arrested a 15-year-old girl for her role in this attack. So you got sisters running around beating the shit out of white women in public. Trying to steal their stuff, man. In the shadow of the White House. Like, if, if the sun is at the right angle, the shadow of the White House of with, with dark in this area right here, man. That's crazy, man. What the hell? Yeah, they the, the D.C., they did vote for this, man. But, I, you know, I, I know this woman, and this woman's going to vote for it again, too. That's the thing about, like, this woman, this woman's torn up about Sonya Massey. This woman right here, she's torn up. She's more upset about Sonya Massey than she is about the ass kicking she just took. Trust me, DC liberal, DC white liberals. This woman is probably this woman is probably not sleeping over Sonya Massey. She got group chats with her other white liberal friends talking about Sonya Massey, man. And she better she better worry about her herself, man. You the one getting your ass kicked. You you really didn't do nothing. You the original didn't do. You didn't do nothing. Kicked her head. I was keeping my head um, covered as much as I could. To be honest, I was. I didn't know anyone was gonna um, come help me. After WUSA 9's reporting, police say they arrested a 15 year old girl for her role in this attack and five others, including some robberies in this span of about a day. I read the story and I go and I see the video and I go, oh my god. It's the same car. It's the same girl. Oh, you got your ass kicked by these black girls? <laughs> God damn, I'm starting to notice a pattern, man. Wait a second, man. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you support the channel via PayPal, Cash App, or the Super Chat, man. Um, I don't think nobody else is covering these stories, man. I don't think nobody else is covering these stories, man. So her, you got your ass kicked by some black girls? And you got your ass kicked by some black girls. What the hell? What do y'all have in common, man? Other than y'all didn't do nothing. Other than it was completely random. Other than the fact that it was, and that it was downtown, like downtown, where like the 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 the, the heart of the of the free world, the, the, the downtown of the capital of the free world, in the shadow of the. <laughs> Of the White House. Wow, man. Um, it's going around beating up white women, man, and broad day. Look at when, look when this, look at when this happened, man. This is broad daylight, man. They kicking white women's ass in the middle of the street in broad daylight. 
I read the story and I go and I see the video and I go, oh my God, it's the same car, it's the same girl. This woman who didn't give her name says two teenage age girls hopped out of a car as she was walking near Logan Circle Monday afternoon. They were giggling, they were just chit-chatting. They didn't appear threatening, but something was off. She said, <laughs> they, they didn't appear threatening, man. <laughs> Logan Circle, that's more in the heart of the city. That's um that's still uptown, but it's it's not this is when she got her ass kicked is not near the White House. This woman got her ass kicked in like it's a gentr gentrified area. It's not it's supposed to be nice. If it was if it was all white people over here, you could eat off the ground. <laughs> you could leave your door open at night. And you could eat off the ground, but you know, we we over there too, man. So kind of rough man um you said they weren't threatening man <laughs> uh appear threatening but something was off she says she was being followed by the car and teenagers on foot so she attempted to hide in this alley the car drives uh never hide in the alley man <laughs> ma'am Never hide in the alley, man. Step one, man. We got to do the, the 10 victim commandments, man. Rule number one, never hide in the alley, Sally. Especially if you being, if you being chased by Keisha and Sharonda. Don't ride, don't hide in the damn alley. What is wrong with you white people, man? Road, she gonna hide in the alley. <laughs> oh my God, man! You serious, white woman? You can't be serious, man. You trolling us, man? She trolling us, man. There's no way you have you was being um chased by Dejanay and, and Ron Delisha, and you decided to go duck into an alley to get away from them. Something was off. She says she was being followed by the car and teenagers on foot. She attempted to hide in this alley. The car drives right past me. They see me. They put the reverse lights on. I just bolted into the opposite direction. MPD reports show about 10 minutes after her escape, a woman was attacked and robbed a few blocks away. Something she didn't. Well, uh, you got to give these son teens um, credit, man. They didn't give up. <laughs> Normal kids would have given up, man. They would have, they would have, once she got away, man, once she bolted, some some lesser teens, some, some teens with less drive and less determination would have given up, man. Not these teens, man. These teens, these teens dusted themselves off. At first you don't succeed, dust yourself off and try again. And they and they and they they got they dusted themselves off. They picked themselves up and they went back to the mission, man. And they were rewarded with another white lady, man. <laughs> another white lady, man, to rob and beat the shit out of in broad daylight. Kids, man. <laughs> kids, man. This is a great lesson for kids, man. All you kids that are out here, listen, man. If, if, Life gonna throw you curveballs, man, at times. Sometimes a woman that you're stalking in broad daylight in the nation's capital in a busy um intersection, the woman that you're the, the white woman that you're stalking in broad daylight near a busy intersection in the nation's capital during broad daylight, sometimes she ducks into an alley and gets away. But man, let me tell you, young people, man, out there especially my young African-Americans. Never give up, man. Keep grinding. Keep your head down and keep pushing forward. And another white woman 
will appear near a busy intersection in broad daylight in the nation's capital of the free world. And you'll be able to kick her ass in broad daylight and take all of her stuff. So don't let the white man tell you you can't be nothing, man. Circle Monday afternoon. They were giggling. They were like chit-chatting. They didn't appear threatening, but something was off. She says she was being followed by the car and teenagers on foot. So she attempted to hide in this alley. The car drives right past me. They see me. They put the reverse lights on. I just bolted into the opposite direction. NPD reports show about 10 minutes after her escape, a woman was attacked and robbed a few blocks away. Something she didn't find out until the next day. And then went, oh, wow, you know, in fact, I was right to feel that something was off. She hopes her story reminds people to be aware of their surroundings. If something feels off. Yo, they, yo, look at what they, when they said be aware. They said, if, I hope this story reminds people to be aware of their surroundings. Right when they show goddamn black legs, man. That's racist, man. Y'all y'all think y'all slick, man. Y'all try to be woke at these news channels, but y'all throw it in there real slick. Watch this, man. Oh. She hopes her story reminds people to be aware of their surroundings. If something feels off, if something feels wrong, like, wow, this is odd that this car just stopped in the middle of the street and some people got out. Don't wait to find out. The 15-year-old suspect made her initial appearance in juvenile court early Wednesday morning. She remains in custody pending her next appearance. Indeed. Wow, man. Um, Sonia Massey, man. It's only right. Um, 